The city of Jacksonville has distributed millions of dollars to qualified residents with more to come. Mayor Curry gave an update today on the program downtown at the library as people waited in line to receive debit cards. News for Jax has a team of reporters following the latest developments on COVID-19. We begin with Jennifer Reddy, who's joining us live downtown. Jennifer? Tom, so far, the city of Jacksonville says that they've distributed more than $15 million to residents to help with things like rent and mortgage. And I spoke with one of those residents today who says this will make a major difference. For Angela Jennings. This pandemic has been really hard on us parents. A mother with another baby on the way. Jennings says she was furloughed from her job due to the pandemic. I was housekeeping and our hours dropped a lot. They stopped selling so many rooms due to the fact of, um, you know, everybody not wanting to come in because of COVID. She is one of many who stood in line today to receive a $1,000 stimulus payment. To date, the city of Jacksonville says more than $15 million has been distributed in relief to residents to help them pay for mortgage, rent, and utilities. It felt great. Like, honestly, I just, Thank God for our governor and everybody else, because if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have been able to pay my bills this month. As the city continues helping residents, the mayor says Jacksonville is ready to move into phase two of reopening with hopes of expanding the capacity in restaurants and retail stores by next week. And about that next phase of reopening, the mayor says that he has talked to the governor about that. And as you mentioned, we are expecting to learn more about that in the coming days. Jennifer Reddy, Channel 4, The Local Station.